Welcome to Friday Patriots. Today is November 2nd. And you're tuning into the Patriot Press News. I'm Alicia Oglesby. And I'm Elias Castro. And here are this morning's announcements. Ola Club will be hosting the Day of the Dead event today in the quad during both lunches. Come around to try a uh, Pan de Muerto, get face painted, see the, see the altar created, and take pictures with some props. Also, you can learn more about the culture behind the event. Patriots, our next blood drive is right around the corner and will be on November 28th. Look out soon for your key club in the middle of the quad, signing people up for the blood drive. If you want to become part of key club, it is not too late to become an official member. To attend meetings, make sure to, wait, to make your way to first lunch to Washington 208 and to Lincoln 103 during second lunch. Attention senior CSF members. The California Scholarship Federation opportunity for seniors. The Michelin Memorial Award is open to all seniors who are CSF members in good standing. Members have until uh, the sec December 22nd to submit essays in response to the prompt published on the CSF website. One award of $1,000 will be made. Please read your email for more details or contact Ziani for questions. Good luck. Attention Patriot ladies, girls soccer is starting. Tryouts are starting after school. If you have any questions, please see Coach Madison. As well, baseball tryouts are fast approaching. Make sure to make your way to the varsity baseball field November 27th through the 29th. You must have an athletic physical turned in and a glove, cleats, and practice attire. See Coach Montgomery for any questions. Any Patriot girls interested in water polo? Practices have started this week over at Drop Zone from 3.30 to 5.30. You must have a physical turned in to play. If you have any further questions, email Randy Schumann. Heritage, some of you may have noticed that Avid has started their Thanksgiving food drive. Now is our chance to give back to our community by dropping off non-perishable items to be donated. Some items that are always in need are instant mashed potatoes, packets of gravy, canned goods, boxed stuffing, cake mixes, rice, beans, and many more. Drop off in any of your avid classrooms. This is all we have for you this week, Heritage. Have a great weekend, and we will see you on Monday.